What's up, YouTube? Mopeders. Uh, today, I'm going to paint the seat. Um, I went to the store and picked up uh, some Sim color coat. This is, uh, that's the number, if you guys care. Um, yeah, so this, uh, this stuff is really good stuff. It's made, designed to bond itself to... Uh, uh, interior plastics of cars. Uh, you can use it on vinyl. You can use it on carpet actually too, which is kind of cool. Um, this stuff is really good. It's actually uh, made right down the street for me in uh, South Carolina, Rock Hill. Um, this stuff is great. Uh, highly recommend it. It's a little pricey, but worth it. Uh, worth every penny. Um, a little prep work involved before we start painting this thing. Um, we want to scrub it down with some soap and water. Just get, if there's any contaminants on this, we want to get it off before we spray it. Um, from, you know, I think Sim actually makes like a, uh, like a uh, prep can too that you spray on here to prep the surface of this after you clean everything. Um, I'm not going to do that. Um, I, I spoke with a, a paint guy like a couple of years ago about this. You know, and he said that, you know, this can already has properties in it that bond itself to vinyl and stuff. So prepping it is, you know, it, I mean, it, it probably helps, but you're going to spend an extra $20, $30 on that other can, you know. So I was like, you know, whatever, screw it, you know, and especially on something like this, it's a seat, you know, if it does wear through to the pink again or something like I can easily just dust some more black on there and it'll be all right. But, um, yeah, let's get started on this. Uh, we're going to clean up some of this dirt and stuff that you see on here. Hopefully I can get that off. Um, yeah, get all that off before we uh, paint it. Um, it's actually, uh, I guess whoever threw this on here didn't staple it to the, there's a plastic pan that sits in here. I guess they didn't staple it down. I'm going to do that too, um, to the plastic um, I'm going to pull this foam out so I can take this inside and scrub it with some soap and water. And hopefully my girlfriend doesn't freak out while I'm doing it. So the seat is good and dry and clean and ready for paint. Um, it's currently raining outside right now. It's uh, Christmas Eve and I'm out here doing this stuff. <laughs> uh, yeah, so basically when you paint it with this stuff, you just kind of dust it on there. Um, dust it on like that. It's going to look kind of wet when you go on with it and it should dry with like a nice uh, matte glossy finish. Yeah, I hate painting in here with all my bikes, but it should be alright. It's not like I'm painting a car or some shit. <laughs> Trying to dust this stuff on there. That's it right there. This really is amazing paint. Like once I finish, you guys will see.
one of the main reasons I'm doing this is because you can't you can't find like seats for a Yamaha Sting. I mean, I've looked online and there is nothing out there than what I could find. <laughs> And this is kind of, you know, I'm not trying to spend all the money in the world on this thing. I have to reposition my grip. <laughs> it's actually like a pretty warm day out today, so. Stuff should dry pretty quick. one spot I just cannot hit with my hand right there without getting black paint all over my arm. Regrip. Actually, let's see if I can see if this stuff even covers. Hold it like that. That's pretty much it, y'all. Check that out. Once it completely dries, um, let's put it down. I might hit it with another coat just to get, you know, some kind of like around the seams and stuff. Seems like getting that paint in there is kind of hard. Not bad. Okay, so for this part of it, um, you can see I've already got it painted. Turned out pretty good. Um, I'm gonna need to use my staple gun to staple this seat pan. Staple the uh, vinyl to the seat pan. So I think I'm going to work my way around. I'm going to start at like the, the tightest spot first, which is the back. It seems like. Uh, let's see. Let's get pull on it a little bit. Get it kind of where we want it. Pull that over right there. Yeah, there nice. Just like that, as you can see, the staples are holding it. Some of them didn't go in all the way, I'm going to try to hammer it in. Just hammer it down. Looks pretty good.
cool so here is the finished product um, as you guys can see um, it's got some shine to it a little bit more than what I wanted but like it's like you know it it's not sticky or anything like that paint is amazing like it it literally like is part of the vinyl you know, like it's like I bought it that way um, this stuff sh shouldn't wear off either like with me sitting on it um, a lot uh, it's good stuff uh, yeah let's flip this thing over I don't have it latched down right now but you can see all the staples and everything I did in there to hold it Yeah, so one step closer to uh, getting this thing where I want it. Uh, I still need to order uh, tires and the kit. And I actually found out I have a, a tire over there that will fit the front, which should be pretty cool. It's brand new. It's a little knobby tire. Uh, should be perfect for the front. So I really only need to order one tire. Um, I'm going to paint all this. I can't wait to do that. Uh, the foot pegs and everything. As you can see also too, I, I got rid of all the red blotches. Uh, red blotch stickers and I got rid of the little eagle that was up here. Um, yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna uh, end up tearing this whole thing apart. I think that'll be the next video. Uh, me taking down, taking off all the plastic pieces and things that I'm gonna paint. Um, that should be the next video. But uh, tell me what you guys think. Um, Sim is a really good brand. I'm not being paid or anything to advertise them. Like, it's a it's great, great company. Uh, uh, good quality stuff. Uh, yeah, I think that about wraps up this video. Um, let me know what you guys think. If you guys like it, um, hit the su subscribe button. Um, cool. Thanks.